Six weeks ago, Ronan Farrow of The New Yorker published disturbing allegations against CBS chief Les Moonves. Uh, women on the record accusing Moonves of harassment and other allegations. Now, Farrow has published another story, a second story with even more detail and even more reporting. This story, just published on NewYorker.com, uh, says that six women have raised new assault and harassment claims in incidents that took place between the 1980s and the early aughts. There are some details in this story that I want to ask Farrow about, and he's joining me now by phone. So, Ronan, you've just published this new reporting. Uh, why is it that you've been able to basically have a part two? You had a part one in July. Uh, mm -hmm. What did it take time to have other women be willing to go on the record and speak out now? Well, there are two things that I'd highlight here. One is these are more numerous claims. These are six women, all of them on the record. Um, also describing more serious allegations. You know, this includes uh, multiple allegations of either physically forced or, co or coerced oral sex. Um, it includes a case that resulted in a criminal investigation. Um, and the, the reason, Brian, that these women are coming out now is that they have been extraordinarily frustrated by what they perceive to be inaction on the part of CBS and its board. And that really is integral to what prompted this follow-up story. Les Moonves, of course, uh, a legendary broadcasting executive, one of the best-known CEOs in America. Uh, but in